Hey, Talk Shop Live. We're Jason and Allie, the Style Guys, your fashion, lifestyle, and fun connoisseurs. Thanks for tuning in. Yes, this is uh, week three. We now have official note cards, so you know that this is for real. OK, yes, we are not playing anymore. Um, we're super excited to be here. Like I said, it's our third week. And we want to thank you for all your support, all the amazing comments that we've had in our other lives. God, it's been such a fun experience for us. And we're so glad to be here. And thank you for tuning in. Now, if this is your first time tuning in to a live shopping event, don't be scared. It's going to be really, really easy for everybody. All you got to do is make sure that if you're watching us, that you are logged in or set up an account at talkshop.live. You're going to see us in there. And then on the screen, you're going to have the option to look at the photos of the products up close. You can, of course, buy. And um, what's really fun, too, is that you can join us in the chat. And we really want to encourage you to ask us questions, make comments. If you want to see us model something, we can do that. It'll be, it'll be really fun when we have caftan week. Mm -hmm. Allie's going to model some caftans for you. <laughs> and um, yeah, and just keep it really interactive. We really want to have fun with you today. Absolutely. And we're so glad to be here to represent some local, um, amazing shops that are out there. I feel like right now it's a bit of a strange time. Um, not all of us can go out shopping because of all the restrictions. So we really want to make this an amazing platform to support local and to support those shops that really need some help right now. And so we are so excited this week to have a Desto man here. Um, they are an amazing local shop here in Calgary. They, we actually met them first time when they were doing a pop-up. Yeah, I know. They were on the pop-up circuit for quite a while and they have totally exploded. They are so popular now. <laughs> yes, two brick and mortar shops. They have an incredible online presence um, and they are ever expanding their collection of items and they have so many fantastic things to show us today. Um, so today we have uh, Abdul Ahmed here. Thank you thank so you, much thank for you. being thank here. Thank you for having Welcome us. Yeah, Abdul. super excited. Looking dapper Ooh. in the morning, boo. I'm I trying like to just it. keep up with you guys, you know. Wow. Like, <laughs> we appreciate it. You look great. Thank, thank you, you so much. much for being here. I'm not going to lie, I felt some pressure when I was getting ready this morning. <laughs> I wanted to really up my game um, yes. because I knew that we were going to have Mr. Worldwide <laughs> in the house. Let's go, guys. Yes, totally. We turned this into a concert. <laughs> yeah, no. yeah, absolutely. And well, now you, you can't see him off camera, but we've also got Ayaz, who is Abdul's partner, and I really want him to come in. He's being a little bit bashful, <laughs> but before this show is over, you're going to see this guy. Yeah. yeah. We are talking full Bollywood star. Yes. Okay. It's so good. And I don't know if you guys know this, but I have a little bit of a thing for brown guys. <laughs> yeah, he does. Yeah. So there, so there's Amazing. that. We went there okay, <laughs> on Talk Shop Live. We went there. <laughs> well, right. let's get down to it. I mean, we're here to shop. We're here to look at all of the amazing things that you have brought for us. Yes. Um, but before we get into that, we have a few questions for you. So for you sure. can kind of tell the viewers exactly what you're all about, what Adesso Man is all about, and why you're here. Yeah, awesome. So tell us about Adesso Man. What do yeah. We know? So Adesso Man is a lifestyle brand for men. We, we've been around for about five years now. Uh, we're actually coming up to our five year anniversary, which we're excited about. You know, um, last couple of years were a little bit shaky, so we weren't sure we we're going to make it. But uh, <laughs> here we are. Here we are. Um, but yeah, our whole concept was to create a, um, a lifestyle brand for men that was inspired by European design, um, influence and also be affordable at the same time. We found that, especially here in Canada, in, in our region here in, in uh, Calgary, there, was a, there wasn't a lot of options. So mm -hmm. um, that's how we started out. Uh, we started out being an accessory brand at first, and then uh, we moved to, to expand our lineup to include a full range of lifestyle products from grooming, leather goods, we have fashion accessories, now we're moving into apparel as well. Uh, and then we also um, love to support up and coming um, local and Canadian brands too. So, 
you know, it's, it's an exciting time for us as we expand into this new world. And uh, yeah, we're happy to be here to show off some of the items that we've created and designed and put a lot of passion into. So yeah, excited to, hear, to be here and show you guys what we got. Well, awesome. we, we can definitely see that you have a lot of passion for what you do and love for what you do because it really represents in the product lines that you have. Um, and you said that you started off as an accessory um, kind of line, mm -hmm. but there's there's three partners, yeah. right? Yeah. So do you, all three of you, do you guys kind of share a common sense of style and aesthetic or do you guys kind of bring a little something different? Yeah, we're all very unique in our own uh, fashion sense and our style. Um, you know, my business partner, Ayaz, who is also our creative director, I would say is probably the most fashionable one out of all of us. Um, he definitely brings a lot of flair, a lot of boldness uh, with his his personal style, which you know we incorporate into our brand quite a bit. Uh, bold colors and designs and patterns, uh, taking a little bit of a risk when it comes to fashion and, and his personal style. Uh, whereas me, I'm you know I'm, I'm a little bit of a classic guy. You know I like things simple, uh, but I'm not I'm not afraid to take risks. Uh, depends on my mood, but uh, <laughs> these days I've been quite in the comfy mode of things and really looking at functionality and comfort when it comes to my personal style. And then we have Lucas. Lucas is our, um, he's, he's basically, you know, I would say the heart of the company. He makes our dreams and our ideas come to life and, and really um, work on uh, sourcing and production uh, of our products. And, uh, and he's, He's a little bit more on the conservative side, I would say, when it comes to his fashion. But, you know, we push him quite a bit to try new things as well. But, you know, there's three different um, styles here. But we, we always say, you know, your personal style, um, you know, being original is really important mm -hmm. um, and, and really owning that and really being yeah. confident about your own personal style. You don't have to be like anybody else. You don't need to try to copy anything else. And we really promote, um, you know, your own a personal sense of style a lot within our brands. So. I Amen. love that. Yeah. That's why we're here. <laughs> That's totally why we're here. And I think that, you know, style is changing and it's ever changing. Like you said, I feel like a lot more people want to be, you know, maybe they're not dressing in suits all the time because they are at home. But I feel like that doesn't mean that you have to lose your sense of style and just be in pajamas all day. I yeah. feel like there there's a sense of kind of mental health that also really comes with dressing up in the morning and looking good and feeling good. And I feel like this is why we wanted to have you on because I feel like it's so important, especially now, to be able to look your best, feel your best, and dress up like you give a damn. Well, and I, I, love, honestly, I love the vision. I actually took this right off your website. To change the way men feel about themselves through fashion and self-care. Well, come on. And I want to be clear, too, that it's not just a dress man. It's not just for the men. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? Fashion, yes. You said a lot of women shop from you as well. Absolutely. We get, we get uh, quite a few women coming in. Again, we're, you know, we're not gender specific. Of course, we're, you know, primarily a men's brand, but, you know, we, we definitely promote our products as, as unisex. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, they're not just for just one specific group. And at, at the end of the day, one thing that you really, uh, what you mentioned was feeling good about yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we see, especially in today's time, how social media, this, this, this need for attention that's happening and people are, are losing their own self identity within this rat race of getting attention. So we really promote uh, self love, self care, investing in yourself. Uh, and that's why, that's where our self care products also come into play. It's not just about the fashion accessories, but also, you know, really taking that time to have a morning routine and really put in time to yourself. I know for a fact, like when I wake up and I put time into dressing up and um, having my morning routine and getting out in the day, I feel a lot better. I feel mm -hmm, so yeah. much more confident. I'm out there to get it. And whereas like if I'm rolling out of bed, I don't really wash my face or shave or, or whatever, I'm not feeling my best. So it really translates into, into the rest of your day and your attitude for sure. So let's start there yeah. with our shopping. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna talk about your amazing collection of grooming products. It's a self-care moment situation. <laughs> yes. I love that. Yes, I love sir. It. Yes, so sir. we did an interview with uh, Mr. Turk a few years ago, who um, is an amazing designer. And we asked him, what do you think is the key to style for men? And he said, it all starts with grooming. Mm -hmm. If a guy is well-groomed, everything else is icing on the cake. So let's get into that. We've got 
some really beautiful beard grooming sets. I was checking these out earlier. Let's talk about it. Yeah. Absolutely. Obviously, I'm a bearded man, um, and I don't have much else to take care of. <laughs> <laughs> so I do, I do put a lot of time and effort into my beard, and, and especially these days, we're noticing a lot of COVID beards happening. And, and my suggestion always is, you know, take that time to really groom yourself and keep things nice and tight. It makes you feel good. Look, it looks good. It's a lot more presentable too. Impressions do matter. Uh, I think especially in how you're presenting yourself out in the world uh, will affect how you feel about yourself too. So, sure. you know, this grooming kit is a three piece kit. I love it specifically because it pretty much does everything that you need to. Um, okay. um, I do suggest, you know, really having a great barber too. But if you are at home and you need something quick, our three-piece kit uh, features a boar hair uh, bamboo brush. We've got a styling comb, which is sandalwood, and we also have uh, some uh, really cool vintage stork um, trimming scissors too. So basically, um, the brush, it's great for a little bit of a thicker beard. Okay. Um, I still use it too, and it, it really exfoliates the skin. A lot of people don't realize that um, there's a lot of dead skin under that beard, mm -hmm. and yes, especially in a dry, dry climate. Dry climates, yes. Yeah, so, and we don't, we don't really exfoliate the skin underneath our, our, our beards, and that's why it starts to get itchy. Sometimes you get, um, sometimes you get uh, beard dandruff as a well. ingrown. Ingrown hairs and things like that. Um, it also it also helps um, get the blood flow going in your skin too. So the longer your beard gets, the less natural oils it's getting from your skin. Mm -hmm. So it's really great to continuously exfoliate. We suggest getting an amazing beard oil. We you know we've got a ton of options uh, at our shop too. But you know beard oils are a big thing. Put on some beard oil. Really work it into your skin, mm -hmm. and then brush. You know, and the feeling, oh, it's, it's actually. Okay, oh. well, you know what? I don't okay. have one of those, and I actually have a COVID beard. Um, yeah. <laughs> I never thought I would have a beard, but again, because of COVID, I was at home, and I was like, well, why don't I give it a try? But and I'm, now it has to stay forever. Well, yes, because when I shave it off, I look like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> Like literally, like I me. feel you on and that one. Yeah, I've done that, that before, and people did not recognize me. People refused to yes. even be friends with me. So there's like, something to be said right. about having a beard and kind of it giving you a bit more swag. Yeah, don't you think? Yes. I feel like it gives like me it. my power. You know, I shaved yes. my beard off about a year ago, and I, I felt like a baby too. But I felt like I lost all my mojo. <laughs> it's gonna have to stay. That beard grooming set is 60 US dollars. 60 bucks. For yeah. our Canadian shoppers, that works out to about 75. So don't be afraid. It's gonna ship to from Canada to you in Canada. And they're and doing free shipping. Free international shipping. Yeah. Fabulous. So we love that. We love that so much. And I think this also would make a really good gift for that person that maybe has a COVID beard. Yeah. This would be such a nice delight to kind of get in the mail and be like, oh, well, absolutely. a little something, something. I, I, it's actually one of our top gifts uh, as well. So, I mean, like you said, great gift, personal use as well. Um, I did want to mention the styling comb that's in there too, yes. which is our, which is our, ooh, sorry. <laughs> our styling comb that has, uh, it's sandalwood too. So it's great for just, you know, taming your beard sure. down as well. And then, Get rid of the strays, guys. Okay, you know, yes, your yeah. mustache needs to be trimmed. Keep it tight. Don't let it go over your lips. I know. It's not a good look. You know, keep it nice and clean. There's nothing you know, worse than having a little lip tickle. Lip, lip, <laughs> lip tickle. <laughs> Okay, oh, so I Allie. don't know. We've got, we've got our Vanna White here who's yeah. going to help us just read out some questions. So when you have a question, Vanna, let us know. Do you have any yet? You oh, do? great. Okay. okay, I love it. Let's hear it. So we have one person asking what the goal is for in the shape. Oh, the oh, shaving okay. set. So oh, we're, we, we're not there yet, but we're we're, not, we, yeah. we we'll, can get there, yeah. We'll okay. get to the bowls. Let's, go, let's move right into yeah, it, should we? Perfect. Okay, yeah. so Great. the question was, what is the bowl for? Yeah. And that's actually our next product. This is the Silver Safety Razor Set. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and, and there's, there's also a matte black version. And there's also and a matte black, black version. Which is gorgeous. And Absolutely. These are also three pieces, so maybe you can talk us through what each of those pieces are. Yeah, so actually, they're four pieces. Oh, so four it's, it's, it's a complete shaving set. So, we, you know, there's a massive trend going back to traditional shaving. Um, you know, people are starting to find that it's a lot more of an affordable option. Um, I find it to be a better shave. Multi blades can actually be quite abrasive on the skin, especially if you have sensitive skin. You can break out. 
uh, there's ingrown hairs, mm -hmm. uh, razor burn that can happen for multi-blades. And I have a really sensitive neck. So for me, a single blade is, is, is quite useful. Okay. So it helps, uh, helps me have a better shave. And then it's a lot more economical. The plastic waste that goes into, sorry, environmentally friendly as well. Mm -hmm. So the plastic waste that goes into um, the, the disposables is quite a lot. And For then, sure. yeah, affordability is another important aspect of this. The blades are quite expensive. Disposable mm -hmm. blades, as you guys know, uh, can be quite expensive. So over time, you end up saving quite a bit uh, of money. But it's a beautiful set. Um, you know, it looks great in your bathroom mm -hmm. as well. Um, and it's, it's quite affordable. It's 99 $99 okay. US for a full shaving set can make a great gift uh, for personal use as well. And yeah, we're, we're finding that a lot of guys are switching over and not switching back. So okay. yeah, okay. it's been so great. Like, it's, yeah. bowl. So what is going, what we're is not going to use our, okay. are we using our can of shaving cream to go in the bowl or how is that going to work for us? First of all, I do not suggest. He's like, how can, dare you? Can dare shaving you? soap is not the best shaving Sorry. soap on the planet, but there's amazing <laughs> brands out there that do, you know, traditional shaving soap that have, you know, shea butter in it. They have moisturizing uh, aspects to it. So it doesn't dry your skin out, but basically you would take either dip your, dip your brush mm -hmm. into your shaving bowl, uh, into your shaving soap, and then right into the bowl and lather. Instead of using your hands, yeah. instead of getting your hands messy and applying it with your with your hands, use the brush. It lathers really nicely. It's a bit of an experience as well. Sure. It feels nice on your skin. I do it on my head quite a bit every day. Um, and yeah, so it, it's definitely a little bit of an experience. It keeps things nice and clean too, so you you don't have a messy sink either. So that's what the bowl is for, for okay. everybody that's wondering. There's yeah. a real so, romance around this. Yes. You know, it's not like just taking a can out of your drawer and getting in your hand. I mean, this, this feels very chic. Well, it does. And let's talk about the price point too. It's like $99, um, which is like about 125 Canadian dollars. Um, when you're buying constantly those um, razors and things like that, they add up. I oh, mean, yeah. you know, at the, I mean, drugstores don't have them in a like lock and key for no reason. They're expensive. <laughs> People are stealing them, but I feel like this is really great. So, how does how does the work how does it work when you have to change the blade? Like, so you have to yeah, buy so, the yeah, razors so, separately. Yeah, so yeah, so the razors. I mean, now you can get them at any drugstore. We do sell them on our shop too. But basically, it's those old school single blade razors, yeah. right? The rectangular things mm -hmm. that you've probably seen your grandpa using at some point, which are now popular again. Yeah. So it just the top For both of us? Well, this is live, so anything can happen. And bear with us happen. one second. Oh, we're good. We're yeah, right okay. now? Okay. <laughs> anything can happen. Well, you know, maybe that's a, a cue. That's like the hook to move on to the next product. Yes. <laughs> so, and this I'm really excited about because you guys design all of your own leather goods. That's right. I was checking these out before. They are so luxurious. They're so practical. I love it. And let's start with the hanging leather toiletry bag. Awesome, yeah. Um, and let's talk about material, first of all. Perfect, yeah. So our collection right now, uh, we just launched this at the beginning of our, our first quarter, um, and it's our brand new leather collection. And one of the items that it features is our toiletry bag over here. The materials that we use uh, at this point are, are leather. They're top grain cowhide. Um, we work with sustainable factories. Um, that's something that you know we we feel as a brand um, is our responsibility to really 
uh, start thinking about um, our, our practices and, and, and our, our impact on the environment. Um, so we actually work with our factory to, you know, take you know, the dead stock that these factories have, mm -hmm. um, that's just waste leather right. and reuse it. And so we took their dead stock and we created our collection. That's so, amazing. you know, it, it is a quite a sustainable collection uh, from, a, from a material standpoint. So we're really excited about that. And yeah, this was uh, our toiletry bag that we designed. Um, Ayaz and Lucas were the, were the designers for sure for this, this one here. And so basically what we did uh, with this guy, as you can see, it fully opens up. Amazing. And it's a hanging option. Yeah, and lots of pockets, which, a which lot is, of for pockets. Me, is yeah. number one. I yeah. want to keep everything separate. Totally. I hate it when you have to reach in and everything is just a jumbled up one pocket situation. So how many pockets are on this? Yeah, there, there, there's multiple pockets. So you've got a zipper pocket at the top. You've got another pocket here. You've got a larger section, so that's three. You've got two smaller pockets here, so that's five, six pockets, lots of zippers. Um, the idea here was this packs flat too, rather mm -hmm. than other toiletry bags that uh, you know a little bit larger. Right. And you have the option to really set it on your bathroom door uh, when you're traveling um, as well. So rather than have it right on your sink, because there's easy nothing access. worse. There literally is nothing worse. Jason and I, when we were traveling, we were actually on a plane pretty much like twice a month, and you know, you would get to the hotel room and all of a sudden it's like we're unpacking our toiletries and we both have these big giant things that sit on a vanity and mm -hmm. it's like, okay, well, you're like rifling through it. You're like, oh my God, where's my moisturizer? Where's my face yeah. wash? This is a really nice way to kind of hang it. Everything is organized. It's super simple. Absolutely. I love that. And this one uh, retails for 179 US, 179 US dollars. And I'll add one more thing. Um, for away. the ladies that are watching, this makes for a great makeup bag too. So if, you, if you're looking for a, you know, uh, a makeup bag that's not as bulky, mm -hmm. this okay. would be your go-to. That's so. fantastic. Right. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. We have another question. Vanna White, what's our, what's our question? If someone could ask how it handles spill, is it easy to clean? Oh, absolutely. Okay. The question is, how does it handle spill? Absolutely. So leather, um, it's not waterproof, but uh, definitely the exterior, um, you know, there's a ton of leather care options. Uh, there's a Canadian um, brand called Bee Seal, Canadian Bee Seal, and it's made from organic bee wax. And you can you can put it on your leather and actually creates a protective uh, layering on top of the leather. So it's great Beautiful. for all your bags, um, any leather options as mm -hmm. well. Even you can use it on your furniture too if you like to. Yeah. But the inside is it's right. a, it's a it's a poly lining, so it's not um, it's not leather on the inside. It is water, fully waterproof on okay. the inside. So I can yeah. wipe and that toothpaste off. off. <laughs> and and you can there. clean, yeah, absolutely easy to clean. Amazing. Sure. Oh, that's great. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Great. Okay. That's fantastic. What's let's, next? Let's move on. We're going to talk about the leather travel holder. Amazing. Let's see it. Not that we're traveling, but we're when we can. hopefully when, when we, we can. can. Yes. But even outside of that, you know, I find that I've got a lot of things. I put a lot of things in my pocket sometimes, mm -hmm. especially when I'm traveling. I'm not the most organized person on the planet, but uh, anything that can make my life easier, I'm gonna go for it, yes. right? So this is where we came up with the concept of our travel holder. Um, it's, it's, you know, it's a very sleek design. Um, it comes with a holder for your phone, all your cords. You have a zipper compartment for if you wanna put cash, your boarding pass, any other essentials in there. There's a card holder option as well, which fits one, two, three, four, five, six cards you can put in there, which is great. Your and MasterCard, your Amex, your Visa, your uh, vaccine passport. <laughs> well, your va and then, yeah, your vaccine passport. Yeah. Um, so yeah, there's a there's a slot for your passport as well and, and uh, a pen too, so you can have everything organized. It also will fit a, a smaller tablet too, if you wanna okay. slide okay. a tablet in there. And yeah, it's it's, Nicer than walking around with a bunch of things in your hand, and you yes. can, you know. And thank you for including the cords in that little yes. pocket. Yes, yes. There's nothing more frustrating than you know you've got your your you know your phone charger, you've maybe got a tablet charger. It's just nice to keep these things organized. Absolutely, Absolutely it is. And Functionality because, was the key for this collection for us. We wanted to make sure that you know we offered great value and mm -hmm. functionality with this entire line. I so, love it. It's yeah. really well thought out, which and, is super important. And you know? it's 149 US dollars, That's about right. 188 in 
Canadian. Mm -hmm. um, I love this as a gift for um, for Father's Day. Yes. Yes. Coming up. And you know, I feel like these things are also really good if you are planning a wedding and you have your yes. bridal party mm. and you're thinking about, oh, I need to find that perfect price point to really um, gift my mm -hmm. gift the people that are helping you out. These are beautiful. Groomsman gifts and all the things. Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Now, I let's, love that. I think we're going to size up. So the yeah. next one is Level the up. messenger bag. Okay, that is just behind us over here. Part of the same collection. So everything's in the black leather okay. uh, as part of this collection. So again, we wanted to keep it classic, mm -hmm. really focus on the functionality again with this line. Um, so this one here, it retails at 379 and um, it's, a, it's a briefcase style, as you can see. Um, it also has an option in the back here, so you can slide it over your luggage uh, as a carry-on. Oh, that is which amazing. not a lot of not a lot of bags have that. You're right. And so it makes it easy when you're traveling. You're at the airport. Um, you know, very um, heavy-duty handles as well. That's something that we definitely wanted to make sure that we had with our with our collection. Uh, and it's super functional. You've got a front pocket. Um, and then the really cool part with this one, again, organization and functionality was at the, at the top of our priority list when we were designing this. And um, when you open this one up. Oh, I love that it opens fully. And it all opens way up. fully all yeah. the way up. Yes. And then not only that, but it has multiple organizational compartments as well as you can see. So again, phone, passport, cards, pen, cords, zipper compartment, and then laptop compartment as well, which will fit about a 13 and a half inch to a 14 inch laptop. But if you do have a bigger, uh, a bigger laptop, we have a second compartment, which oh, I love as it. well. Okay. Wow. So for all your, you know, extra documents, a larger laptop, it can fit up to a 16, 17 inch as well. I love that. And then it comes with a crossbody strap too. So if you, if you don't want to use it as a, as a, as a briefcase, you can use it as a messenger with, with a crossbody strap as well. So yeah, it's uh, again, functional piece, um, you know, depending on how you want to use yes. it for work, for travel, it's a, it's a really that. great and option. This, so this is 379 US dollars. That's for right. 475 Canadian. Yes. I can tell you that we have been known to sometimes buy some, let's say overpriced luxury bags <laughs> over the years and they do not have pockets like that. No, they don't. And I you're mean, just like, why am I paying this much money for a bag that doesn't even fit my laptop yeah, anymore? Yeah, you can easily spend a thousand bucks mm -hmm. and get half the functionality. So I love that. I love this too. Let's talk about the Weekender bag. Oh, this we're is, really getting this is, it. this is one of my favorite pieces that we designed. Um, you know, Ayaz and Lucas, again, uh, amazing design with this, this piece here. So we wanted to create another functional piece. And as you can see, we have our weekender bag up here um but what's really cool is what it opens up fully oh, as same, well that's it's the same, the same. Oh, i thought they were two different bags no so a lot of people don't realize there's a garment bag built into this so again you know oh instead gosh. of having multiple uh bags in your hand yes. where you have your garment bag separately uh, we decided to kind of combo both options we created a a, a built-in garment bag which opens up fully you can have your dresses if you want, or your suits, yes. jackets, shirts. There's a hanger right here, so it hangs in, yeah. zips all the way up, and then it becomes the bottom of the bag. Oh my God. And the bag zips up fully. There's four more compartments on the inside. There's a shoe compartment as well, so you can keep your shoes separated oh. from your clothes, okay. which, is, which is a phenomenal, I think from a functionality standpoint, which is a, fun a functional, uh, piece this, to this is bag. a game changer, y'all. Like this is incredible. I've actually oh never my seen God. the bag I... unzip to be yeah. quite like that because it I haven't does either. look and like yeah. a single, just a normal bag. And then bag. and then fully done up. And so you can't chic. you can't even tell. I this love that. So and it has a, a strap. As yeah. Well. So again, so it comes with a crossbody strap as well, a large front pocket. So you know you can put a ton of things in here. Um, as well. And then again, we did a second pocket on the back. Again, if you want to put your, your passports or anything like that. And then another uh, little oh, to go on your, to go little, on your, to go on your oh, luggage. On. Yeah. That's okay, that is fantastic. Beautiful. I love it. That one is 490 US yes. dollars, about 616 was the math I got on 
that in Canadian dollars. <laughs> well, I, I mean, mean, that is, but also, you're getting like three different bags. That's exactly, exactly, yeah. exactly. Yes. So worth it. I love that bag so much. We're going to have to get one of those. Yeah, <laughs> yeah value, value and functionality, right? 100%. Like, we wanted to make sure that the, the, the it was also affordable. Mm -hmm. You know, there's, there's a lot of options out there that are quite expensive. Very and cool. Well, and yeah. I love, any questions? Not yet. Yeah, okay. so make sure yeah, you guys keep yeah, keep the questions coming because I feel like there's so many questions that we have that yeah. we want to ask. Um, I love that weekend or bag too because I feel like a lot of people now are going on weekend getaways and not necessarily, you know, month getaways or week getaways. This is a really great thing because you can just pack all your things in one have everything kind of nailed down into like that gorgeous weekender bag. It looks awesome. I love the color. It's fantastic. Oh, we do have oh, a we question. Have more questions. <laughs> What's the question? Does the weekender fit in overhead on airplanes? Yes. Oh, oh, that's a great, great question. question. I'm just going to repeat the question. Yeah. You can't always hear it, but it, does that weekender fit in the overhead compartment? Are you going to have a fight with a flight attendant if you take that <laughs> off the plane? Yes, absolutely. We took uh, we took uh, all the dimension dimensions into consideration when it comes to it being a, a carry on bag. So it is carry on compliant, and uh, you will not have any fights with. Uh, these oh my God. Yeah, okay. totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You heard it here. Yeah. Yeah. Good. You good. I um, love. I love that you guys have really thought about everything. Yes. And you know, I feel Thank like you. that really is a true testament about your product and your brand. Is Thank that you. you guys really go above and beyond in thinking about those things. The details. Yes, it's really important. I love that. Uh, we also we have one more leather item. Actually, two more things. Yeah. Uh, the leather document holder. Yeah, absolutely. Again, another piece part of this collection functionality. At the, at the main of this design as well. So it's a beautiful piece. I find this to be one of my favorite pieces as well. Great for business, great for meetings, great it. for organization. You will have an outside um, compartment as well. So, you know, documents, uh, brochures, things like that. Mm -hmm. um, you know, great for a sales person. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, notepad as well. Uh, you can have your notepad in here. Um, again, cords was a big thing for us, I guess. We put, yeah. we put cord organization in most of our products. Um, and then we also have card holders, business cards, uh, another zipper compartment, and then a slot for your tablet or a smaller laptop as okay. well. So it's, it's a quite a functional piece as well. Um, this guy retails for 179 as well. Love it. And yeah, uh, 225 Canadian. That's, yeah. That's a great price. Mm -hmm. really but is. yeah, makes a great gift too. So if there's any sales guys out there or even just for, for working at home and going into meetings, this is a great, uh, great option. Well, yeah. if our real estate agent can sell our house over list, he might get one. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Do you hear that, Joel? <laughs> Uh, last one in this category, we want to talk about the Money Clip card holder. Absolutely. So the Money Clip card holders are actually one of our top selling items. And okay. uh, we've had them for the last two, three years now. We've evolved them, uh, brought in multiple color options. As you can see over here, um, it's, it's a very minimal piece. Um, you know, we're finding that a lot of guys are kind of moving away from bulky wallets into a lot more of a minimal yes. option. Um, you know, cash is being used less, but not to say people aren't using cash still. So what we did was we took a traditional, obviously card holder and added the money clip to it. Uh, it's, it's magnetic, um, which is phenomenal. I think it holds quite a few cards too. So you have two outer slots and then we also have an interior middle slot that can hold anywhere from um, four to five cards. So I, you know, if you really want to jam cards in here, you can probably fit eight to nine cards. How much okay. cash can I fit in? Yeah. <laughs> I am very rich. How much cash can I fit in? <laughs> um, I, I think with, with our magnet, we've tested it in anywhere from 10 to 15 bills. So, okay. so that's great. And then because uh, the exterior of the clip is also magnetic, coins also uh, magnetized oh, cool. to it too. Okay. So it's a great uh, it's a great option if you're looking for a minimal piece, looking to kind of, you know, get rid of some of those cars that you don't need yes. and also be able to carry it in your front pocket. A lot yes. of guys don't want to uh, have this in their back, uh, have their wallets in their back pocket yeah. anymore. Yeah. So I am a front pocket wallet, wallet carrier and I love how small that is. Yeah. Too. Especially if you're going to wear a nice, there's nothing worse than when you see somebody wearing you know, slim cut pants or jeans, and you see this giant wallet. It's not a good look. 
This is so much better. Absolutely. Yeah. That one is $48. 48 and oh, it comes in multiple color options yeah, what, what too. Options? So we've got so we've got the navy blue, we've got a caramel, we've got a light saddle leather as I well. I love that. Yeah, the, and then we've got the gray and chocolate brown as well. Beauty. Delightful. Oh yeah. my goodness. And that's about 69 Canadian dollars. Mm -hmm. um, I actually was gifted one a little while ago and it wasn't it was a little too bulky for me so I took it back and it was over a hundred bucks so I feel like this is really good value. Yeah, yeah. it is. Oh we have a question. Okay. For the other collect the larger collection will there be a brown leather or is there a brown leather? Oh okay. okay. Will there be a brown leather in the in the other collection, the larger Yeah, collection. so at this point, we came out with just a classic black. Mm -hmm. uh, definitely going into fall, winter is part of our plans to, to introduce a brown a brown collection as well. Oh yeah. my goodness. We'll have you back when that comes yes, out. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, we'll do, we'll do We'll start it. with the black, and then we'll get you into the brown. Absolutely. I like it. I like it. This I is a like metaphor that. for dating as well. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, let's... Just, <laughs> our final category, let's oh. talk about... Socks. Yeah, these I are love fun. Socks. These are fun. And these are so nice. Phenomenal. Yeah, so when we first started out, uh, socks were actually our first product line that we created. Um, you know, we thought about how can men, especially in Alberta, uh, in Canada, elevate their look and feel. And funky socks were starting to become a thing, especially in, in Europe, colorful socks, bold patterns. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, you know, in a subtle way, really making a little bit of a um, unique impact with your outfit, right? Um, so this, our socks are, one of our most popular items, we have over 30 designs that we've done over the last five years now. Um, our collection changes over the years. Um, we have quite a few options. Obviously, we couldn't bring all of them today, but we, we did uh, create a few different packs for you guys. Um, we have a little bit of a, a foodie pack over here. Okay. okay. Yeah. Us, so we've got that. we've got sushi, we've got pineapple, <laughs> and we've got bananas. Oh. Yeah. Yes. Oh my god. So if you're you know if you're a foodie, this is a great pack. Um, you know we do the regular price is thirteen dollars, but we do three for we're doing three for thirty. Okay. So ten dollars yeah. each for Love for that. the pack, uh, which is great. And then um, lots of fun colors. Like, you know, we're going into summer right now. And again, hopefully we get to enjoy the sun outside. Um, and why not put on some bright colors? Agreed. Right? I love that. I love, I love socks like this with shorts. Yeah. Wow. Well. You know, like you can really have some fun with your shorts and your shoes and your socks. They don't have to just be those ones that sit inside of the shoe. Mm -hmm. I think it's fun to just pull them up. I mean, it's... God, it's fashion. Have fun with it. Have fun with it. And, totally. and, and, and they don't necessarily have to be worn with a dress shoe, right? You can wear them with sneakers. Yes. Uh, you know, especially the brighter colors. Put on, you know, white white kicks and you are good to go. I love that yeah. so much. Yeah. And it's a great way to kind of add a little something, something to your outfit too. Maybe if you're, you know, a bit afraid of kind of introducing bold colors and patterns into your actual wardrobe, mm -hmm. this is a really nice subtle way of just kind of like having a moment and yeah. all of a sudden, you know, you sit, you know, you're sitting down and all of a sudden you're, you know, your leg lifts up and all of a sudden it's like that bright yeah. bold of color, which is awesome. And I want to share with you something. I was talking to my mom yesterday who is a big curling fan. And she was telling me because the the Scotties are on the big the big championship, and she was saying how one of the teams that's really doing well, it's become a thing that they wear bright bold socks, and people are now sending this team bright bold socks, and it's been all the rage with the curling fans. You guys so. should send the curling guys some socks. Or good guys, <laughs> a pair of your socks. I feel like that would be awesome. I think that's I think it's the a, bananas. The bananas. The bananas. <laughs> I think Don't that's a, I think I think that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think that'd be a great idea. We should definitely look into that. That's great. Um, and again, a really good price. It's the three pack is thirty dollars. Yeah, yeah thirty seven Canadian dollars. And you've got a six pack as well. Yeah, which is so fifty absolutely. or about sixty three Canadian. Absolutely. And then yeah, so that includes another we did another three pack for you guys. It's a little bit more um, you know, less less designs Old, but yeah, more yeah. more you know subtle designs as okay. well with this with the floral, floral yeah oh, with the yeah. floral oh the navy blue geometric and Gorge. then we also did this purple sunset design as well which is really cool so the colors flow really well again this is another three pack for thirty dollars but you can get all six for fifty bucks Amazing. so Amazing. quite a bit of savings there yeah i love so that awesome. yeah um okay that nice. is all the products we're going to show you today but there mm -hmm. is one more thing that we have got to show you and that is Ayaz's 
hair. <laughs> yeah, you have to. You have to. You yeah, have yes, to come on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Yay. Are you ready? I don't even think you're this is, ready. This, oh my this God. is my business partner, yes, yeah. who is also our creative director and head designer as oh. well, who puts all of these ideas together for us. So thank you, Ayaz. Oh, thank you. Fabulous job, I obviously. And yeah. And, and his hair. Yes, hair. and that hair, though. I, yes. I want that hair to have its own Instagram. Account. It should. <laughs> but if people want to follow Adesso on Instagram, it's at Adesso Man. Correct? That's right. That, okay, at Adesso yeah. Man. Any other channels you want? Yeah, to so we're on, on Facebook as well at Adesso Man. You can look us up on Twitter at Adesso Man. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we also have a YouTube channel. Check us out. There's a ton of great styling videos, uh, a lot of behind the scenes about our brand, um, tips and tricks and that kind of thing. So we've got some great content on there. Plus, you can check out our website too, AdessoMan.com. So, yeah. Okay. How incredible. Thank you so much for Thank being you. here. Thank what a great, I love, I love this, this segment so much, guys. Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you. We Thank appreciate you. all the detail that you, you know, put into your product and we were so happy to have you. I mean, supporting local businesses is totally our jam and we are so thankful for you guys to be here. We wish you nothing but the best, lots Thank of you. success and make sure you're asking them all the questions, going to their website as well and shop for these incredible items because they are fabulous we need to get that bag that's right that so we follow do. those guys follow us you can like our page here on talk shop and you'll get notifications of every new episode that we're doing we're doing another one next week that i'm so excited about we yes. are doing it's the, the time and the format is going to change a little bit so stay tuned but we are going to be featuring kate huko and she is going to do a full runway show wow. a shoppable runway show i don't think i have actually never seen one before ever we have so i'm there. so excited she's got an amazing lineup of models it's probably going to be thursday night so just stay tuned for that and make sure you're following us at the style guys ca i think that's it and we love you thank you <laughs> Woo! <laughs>